squads will spread out and continue their search for Jeremy. All units, assemble at the shared location. Based on the intel collected during the operation, Jeremy is heading for... Wait a sec. Isn't that Corel's ship? Why the hell is it there? Each passing day, the demons attacked us less often. That didn't mean there were no casualties. Soldiers, knights, and those who had fallen behind all sacrificed themselves. Thanks to them, we were finally able to evade the demons. There was no joy to be had in surviving. No sorrow to honor the dead. No guilt in freeling alone. And then we faced another onslaught from the enemy. The demons surrounded us and laughed, as if it were clear not a single soul would escape. The moment the weapons blew up, we were all doomed to die. Suddenly, a giant shadow appeared overhead. We only understood what was happening when we looked up. Something enormous had covered the entire sky. It was neither human nor demon. It was pure, unfeeling death. With an eerie sound of screaming metal. It moved its head. And then, the massacre began. Everything that crossed its path died. Humans and demons alike. The demons' weapons continued to spit fire to no avail. But we could not give up our fight for survival. We had lost too much to surrender now. 